you have a fluorescent light fixture that is not working and you've already changed the bulbs, more than likely it's the ballast. So here's how you change the ballast. So before we start, you want to make sure that power is killed to the light fixture. We want to make sure there's absolutely no power going to it. Then we'll get the light bulbs out and take the covers off the top. Normally there's just a pin that you twist to the side and those covers pull right off. Then we're going to locate the black and white wire inside the fixture there. There should be some wire nuts on those. You just want to take those wire nuts off and disconnect those wires. Now there's going to be wires coming off each side of the ballast. We're going to go ahead and snip those on each side. So I just cut the blue wires. Now I'm going to cut the red wire on the opposite side. And once we get that cut, we're going to be able to pull that ballast out of there. It'll be loose. There'll just be one screw that holds it in place. And it's pretty simple to take out of there. So we're going to go ahead and take that out now. So we can use that to go match up a new ballast. Here's a look at the new ballast I got. And it actually has the same type of wiring. It's got one red wire on one side and two blue on the other. And it goes in there the same way. Just with one screw, it secures in place. So we're going to start by getting rid of the extra slack. Uh, you want to leave enough slack to get the wire nuts on, so maybe a, a couple inches overlap, but you don't need that much slack. So we're going to go ahead and bring the two wires together there and, and snip them all at once. And then we're going to do the same thing with the red wire. We're going to get rid of that extra slack. And the same thing with your uh, white and black wire. We just want to get rid of all that slack. After you get all that slack out, now we're going to go and strip the ends of the wire. We need some wire strippers and strip off about half inch off the end of each wire. So we're getting those all stripped so we can connect them together. So we're going to start with connecting the blue wires. So there's two blue wires on the fixture, two blue wires on the ballast. And we want to connect those together. It doesn't matter which ones you use. And now we're going to connect the red wire on the opposite side. There'll be one on the fixture, one on the ballast. Now it's time to connect our power. We're going to connect that white wire from the ballast to the white wire coming out of the fixture and also the same thing, black wire coming out of the ballast to the black wire coming out of the fixture. Once those are connected, you want to get those wire stuff back in there to where we can get our covers back on. Once your covers are on, get the bulbs back in and we're going to be ready for a test. Alright, let's see how we did. Alright, we have power. Thanks for watching. This is CLS All-in-One. Please subscribe.